welcome web coders to the angular js tutorial for the beginners so in last video tutorial we have talk about some features related to the angular js 7 then uh, history of angular js introduction to angular js what is angular js and uh, we have talk about some history and versions and why we use angular js as a web application development framework all right so we got covered about this so in next tutorial we want to see how to install angular js 7 in our computer to write angular js 7 apps so let's just continue we require actually editor for writing the codes for angular js 7 and we require some files related to the node.js so there are two basic editors those we can use for development of angular 7 apps so first we will have as a visual studio code and second we will have as a jetbrains webstorm so you can go among with them but for this tutorial i will be using visual studio code so i will let you know how to install and how to get download the visual studio codes and node.js from the website and install to your computer so let's get started guys so first what we need is we need to download the visual studio code at this website i will provide this link at the description too so i want to go to the website called code.visualstudio.com so i will just let let me open my browser i have my open browser and i will just type here like visual studio code download and by the first link you can give, go to the code.visualstudio.com and slash download you can download for the windows you can download it for the Macs and you can download it for the Linux and Unix too. Alright, so you can download it uh, as of your system is consisting as of 64 bit or 32. You can download it from here. I have already got download. So I will just let me open that download. So I will open my downloads. I have it here. We just do your code. Okay, so I just run up this code. Double click on this setup. All right, I click on I agree just click on next then click on next then click on next and create the desktop icon all right next install we have to wait for some seconds to install this visual studio code in our computer it might get installed within the seconds only then later on we need to install yeah we have done with this visual studio code I will not launch right now we will check it out later so i i am gonna be install visual studio code then i want to run the uh, node js for angular cli the angular j7 is implemented on angular cli so i want to run this code on the node js so i need to download the node js so i will go at the website or you can simply google it like this okay i just click on back and i will just write node js download Okay, there is a standard website for Node.js download is Node.js.org. You can go out there, you can download it for the Windows. You can get out, for, you can check the current version and you can download for the 32 bit or 64 bit. I have already get downloaded. So I will got installed right here. So this is my Node.js. It requires some time to install the Node.js on my computer and we need to configure it. So figure it out, what, what will be the step for it. All right, so I will open this. So welcome to node.js setup wizard and setup wizard will install node.js on your computer right so just click on next i accept click on next okay this will be the standard file you can change the path along with that but i will just let it as it is okay node.js runtime packages then npm manager it will got installed and then online documentation shortcuts and add to path yeah i just click click on next and automatically necessary tool i don't want this uh choc chocolate framework i don't want right now so i'm not clicking on this ch uh, checkbox i just click on install click on yes all right it may got be installed in my machine right now all right by when it is done then we have to configure this npm this node.js with our angular cl and how we gonna be configure let's figure it out okay we have to configure this by such a way like okay i need to open first once it is got installed then i need to open node.js command prompt so i will search it at here as node.js 
I said command prompt. Yeah, after the installation, I can get this Node.js command prompt. I just click on it. So it will got open like this on your users. Then let me run the code for installing Angular CLI. Okay, the code for installing Angular CLI is npm install hyphen g is for generate and which package we need is at the rate angular slash cli it will get download for me by their web servers and it will get install on our machine or you can download this you using some website over there is website called cli.angular.io by there as well you can download this website the website which which will be quite like this i just let you know it will be like cli.angular.io i'm hitting and enter you can get this website and you can get it download okay so here there are some tags which is going to be generated by npm you can check it out here and you can get download by the same too so i am just installing my npm package here okay so once we are successfully installing our package then later on we need to create our project inside our directory and then how to create how to start a server and what will be the first application in angular j7 we'll talk about it requires some time to install on your on your machine Okay, so first it will show you a message like this uh, while at the installation. Would you like to share the anonymous uses of data and Angular team at the Google under the Google privacy? So you can, you can as of your convenience, you can put down yes or no, just but I will provide yes. Okay, so we have successfully installed our package which is called as an Angular CLI right now. So I need to create my project. Okay, so the thing is we have successfully environmental setup to the angular CLI right here. I need to create some project in my folder in my computer. So what I will do in a D drive, I will create first folder. So in my system, I will create a folder right here, which is called as an angular projects. I need at these projects at this folder. I'm going to be create my all the parts of projects here. So this is right, right now empty. What I will do, I will go at this location by the command prompt. So cd angular projects, all right? And we're gonna be created new project here by the npm command as ng new and type of application. I will say my first application. I'm hitting an enter, all right? So it will it will prompt some message like. Would you like to add the routine? What is routine exactly? We will check it later. But right now I said no. And yeah, CSS I need. I just click on CSS and it will got created the project for me. Right? It will again take us some time because it will get some packages from the internet and extract to our project. So it will require some time to get it download and get it extract to our project. So we have to be wait for something that project is going to be downloaded and extract to our folder All right guys here we go we are successfully going to be create a project in angular cli so that how it got to be created it requires some time that's why i pause the video and i until wait for resume resuming this and getting it continue so once it is got continue how to check that is getting successfully or not so it will give a message like added that packages and which contribute that number of packages and within the second so it will got completed about this and once it's gonna be completed at the folder our application has been created now let me check i will not open this application inside any uh, editor or what what i will do i will open my node.js again node.js command prompt i said all right i will go to my folder i have closed this that's why I'm doing it again if you are not closed then you are do this continue right so here i am going to be go to my that website which is cd my first application cls and we need to start this and how we're going to be start is simply like ng serve 
and then click on enter so it automatically get compiled the files for the angular environment and once it is got compiled then it will be shows us the message okay it's compiling actually yeah it is successfully got compiled and you can check like open your browser we we going to be check the output on the by opening the browser at localhost colon 4200 so let me check it once i have my browser open and i will go to that one localhost i say it 4200 and i'm hitting an enter the first application will be removed it will be like this okay so this is the first application that we will have it is actually the inbuilt in angular cli so if i going to be change something then how i can change and how i can change i will check it out later so so guys so by such a way we can create a project in angular cli using npm that node js command prompt and using some cli components and all okay so we have successfully got created a project and running into it but now let me open my folder my website folder in my visual studio code editor so i will open my visual studio code right here as of we have installed the visual studio code all right so i have my visual studio code okay so i am going to be write the code for associating with that is i will open this folder so go to the file i say open folder and i will go to my path where my folder is also located okay it, it is at in d drive yeah angular projects and this folder i need to open and just click on select folder so it will automatically got open with all such a files with an angular so what will be the file is what is actually and how we going to be configure the visual studio code we will check it out later but to if we we require some code from uh, that requires to our angular js language so you can install this javascript or type typescript as well so i am going to be install my javascript at here i said okay right and then typescript all right it is automatically got install and reload our window yeah, my window is reloading so i need i don't need the another part so i just keep it it out okay so we need the typescript and javascript that's why i'm going to be install it okay so at the second video at the next video we'll talk about some project structure in angular cli and how to works with the project structure in angular cli and uh, the let's continue with the series at the next point we will talk about how to create the application which is got evaluated in angular js 7 development so guys stay tuned to our channel thanks for watching this video if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet then go click please subscribe to our channel if you like this video give us a thumbs up and thanks for watching this video happy coding bye bye